Welcome to KJ Disc. We are at our home course here. We're playing the Copenhagen Open 2023. You're watching round one, front nine, part of the European Pro Tour. And in case you didn't know, your commentators, Matisse Eske and <laughs> KJ Naibo. And here you see my skill level, your <laughs> skill level, <laughs> and our dynamic. Oh, yeah. I don't give a F. This craft. Oh, yeah. The boss. And our players on our card, of course, KJ Naibo, rocking the new uh, Flune <laughs> oh, yeah. Buzz. Uh, no, sorry. OS. And Jonas Alto. From Finland. Yeah. And Piri Piri, the hottest player from Finland. Spicy. <laughs> Modern Brenner. 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 Rocking the Snoopy putter. And here we are at hole number one. 175 meters. This is a different layout than the normal layout in, in Valpyparken, but um, this is called the Rosen Garden. And uh, you gotta keep it kind of low here. Those branches, the drone fly by. This is where you want to land around here. Good spot. And then the basket is also gonna be down here. OB on the left, Rosen Garden, and the path here is also OB. And um, yeah, you gotta make a good drive with some angle. You gotta put some hyzer on it. And um, so let's see a hyzer from the local. Ho hopefully. Hopefully, yeah. And this the path. Is, it's, it's, there is a lot of wind in this round. Oh. You will see that during most of the holes as well. But um, put some angle on it. And uh, it did, did what I wanted to. And skip is definitely part of the plan here as well. Yeah. Like once you clear the corner, you yeah. want that extra skip. Yeah, you want skip. that skip around the corner to get left. Oh, skip yeah. into a tree? Yeah, still possible. Birdie from there. Probably just a little more straight shot. And this is... Uh, Big arm turning, just going straight. Very straight, and into the tulips. Yeah, We're playing the in the springtime in Copenhagen. Very beautiful, very windy, but you have those beautiful colors. But uh, he nicked a few of those flowers. <laughs> yeah, modern Brenner is putting some angle on it, and wow, to inside. Yeah, yeah, but but it's forgiving this whole inside line line towards the Rosen Garden. And there you see Ooh. even oh there I was about to see even with see an errant wind. drive you have a look, um, and he did have a look, but unfortunate there. But very difficult shot. Especially the wind here. Ooh, Morton Good. going tricky inside. Yeah, very good. Nice. Just outside circle. Having a pot with a little headwind. Look at the pretty flowers. Straight shot. You don't want to turn that over too much. Oh, you got OB creeping up. Yeah, yeah. Good Stop shot. short. Very good shot. Okay. And on these first three yeah. holes, you actually gotta don't keep that low. Yeah. On these first three shots, you actually don't have a, a home course advantage because these are new holes. Yeah. So yeah. you didn't know that ghost branch was there. <laughs> <laughs> I I know that I gotta go, you know, low on it. But yeah. That's still, not. still, this park is just uh It's one of the busiest park, uh, as you told earlier, and. Just um, yeah, busy park to practice on as well. Oh yeah, oh, nice good, start. Good, good, man. Circle two putt. That's a good way to start your day. Oh yeah, good birdie there. Yeah. And for PD you can see as well. that flag there. It's ripping. Yeah. Yeah, it was uh, some tricky conditions out there. Uh, oh, yeah. just low and low right. Tricky conditions. Yeah. And those chains, if you go low on those, it's just, yeah. 
the European Pro Tour has a lot of consistency in their setup, but so they drive uh, the same set of baskets from event to event. But that also means new yeah, baskets yeah. in Valpy Park. Yeah. And here on hole two as well. You are gonna go low here as well, I'm going with the straight drive. You could do this side arm as well, but that's different angle, and you gotta turn it over and try to land right about here. That's a really good shot. You can also just shorten it. But then you're gonna go through all these trees, go over them, or just go through them. You can skip it, you can sidearm it. The upshot is, is a little tight, but uh, the drive is also, you gotta hit that window low right there. And not just like going that. in that bush, that's also oh. part of the, the left kind of window that you gotta hit. And not so relevant on the drive, but when we get to the approaches, we should mention that behind the basket, the path oh, yeah. is OB. That is too high, <laughs> but going through, but uh, getting into the rhododendron bushes. Morden using his ninja skills to get the oh, disc yeah. out from the bushes. There's the tree. That was just too left out of his hand. Going Athena Proto, little head went here. I thought this was going straight. It is. And straight it was, just wind, wind drop, and uh, hitting the path is yeah, a good, good. And shot. this path is not OB, only behind the basket. Yeah. So we had some busy spotters stopping the locals from running that path. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, another, that's right. Another branch, but. He Still coming, getting distance. out there. This is yeah, the dump yard. <laughs> no, this is the rose garden from all the. You got a. What is it called? Sprouts. Sprouts. Yeah, from the rose garden. Cut off. The, the cut off. Yeah, the cut them off. And here, Morten Brenner has to Trying use to more of his ninja skills. Oh yeah, going upside down. That's a fancy shot. Yeah, yeah. Getting up there and having a, an approach from there, a long putt. Beautiful way to park the hole, but he didn't. Yeah. Beautiful disc that can be parked, but he didn't. Oof. Yeah, you <laughs> see those? <laughs> it's yeah, you're in a more comfortable situation here. Yeah. Still hitting something. Getting up there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Little flick of the wrist. Definitely some nervous uh, moments. Somehow the wind is heavy and it's getting tricky. That's just the layup because with that wind, slightly uphill putt. And uh, if you run it, that OB path behind can really get in your head. So we see a bunch of uh, safe layups. Yeah. And Not hot. taking too many risks. Also pretty hot, hot green kind of. I want to skip it all the way up there, then you can. Ooh, and that's a slide. nine meter putt, and that wind is not easy. There no, you see. Oh, you it. can see that gust that came through that sand. Car coming oh. in, people walking by. Oh. Yeah. It's it was a low. good, good day. That'd be parking. Oh, yeah. That's a double bogey. Yeah. That's, uh,. Not the start he was looking for. No, that's true. Yeah, and this whole playing mm, tricky, but you as well. uh, got away with your birdie. Yeah. Hole number three. Yeah, you want to probably here. It's the best choice of a sidearm, keeping it low and uh, coming in around this tree or just before it. But um, the wind is from right to left here, very heavy, so. Yeah, the the any that I practiced was was not uh, not a choice here. So trying to go, maybe I was a little too much left of right there. Too wide. Yeah, too wide. <coughs> the wind just slammed it down and and kind of held it at the left. Same here. You see, they are not going right at all. You got to keep it tight on the right, and then you can 
put your side arm down here. You probably see it right here. Yeah, the fin. Yeah, not really, but still. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. Most of but the young. Still, there's uh, a little little left. Most of the young fins, they have uh, both backhand and forehand. And I can see here. He kind of learned our from our shots, but still a little right. But um, pretty good. But they have uh, deadly forehands. Uh, so does Morton, but not for putting. You don't want to use your forehand ah, when you're good, putting. Good up shot there from Morton. That's a learning for you guys at home. Don't yeah. use the forehand when putting. <laughs> Windy zone around. Yeah, yeah. And uh, of course, you're playing with a brand new bag. This is your first tournament. Yeah. Playing as a disc craft player, so you're learning your new discs, and uh, yeah, it's a tough right. start in this wind, but um, yeah, the zone is a good disc in the wind. It's something that you you not try a lot is just playing in the wind. So definitely, definitely difficult times, but um, interesting times. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> True. And that putter did its job. Yeah. So your score car has red, green, and blue. It's a nice color combination, yeah. even though that's no. not what you were looking for. Yeah. Hello! I started a web shop, kjdisc.com, and uh, this is some of it. We sell disc craft, limited edition, and I just got to show you a bit of what I have in here. This is UV turning purple, the Athena UV. And the Pro of Learning as well on the Zone OS, the BV1. Go and check them out on kjdisc.com. Look, look! It's purple now. <laughs> I totally agree with that guy. Go check out that web shop. Oh yeah, okay. All right. .com. Hole number four. Yeah, this is the normal hole one at uh, Valbyparken. This is um, 177 meters. You gotta roll it or have a good sidearm here. The wind was uh, tailwind today and very heavy tailwind. So rollers were actually, for me, the choice and the other guys sidearm i guess yeah we uh we saw this tournament uh we were filming last year as well you can go check out and uh you see oh tricky roller obviously the path asphalt down there is to the left is ob but that's very nice but last year we saw that the fins showed up and it's like okay you have all your local uh, lines but we yeah. have the power forehands oh yeah so yeah, yeah. modern is a bit inside here yeah too much angle their tailwind just smashed it down and and didn't get get the air that he wanted got to put it more straight i think from the side arm but now you're gonna see one of the finish forehands yeah good power here keeping it low still too much angle you don't get a lot of flight from that but still pretty good still make a birdie from there so far the danish uh, angle has the greatest success but now yeah. this have one has another power. power forehand oh yeah that's still getting some flight and a lot of power just skipping right. long and pretty good spot yeah He'll have an open look there, whereas Morden needs to do uh, get creative with his yeah. stance. Oh yeah, go the inside. To go low straight shot. Keep going, keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. just outside circle two probably, or oh, around circle two. That green is very guarded in there. You see, you're just aiming for. A That's a good shot here. Solid green. Oh yeah. And that gr good gr shot. the green is very clean so you can like count on some slides so yeah, you want to right. approach low yeah the wind here was heavy yeah and uh also velvet is kind of it's not the same wind all the time because you might is just lifting i was it was probably not a good shot anyway but yeah it was weird sometimes it would those discs were just rising the second shot that you did there in your mind, I bet, was yeah. perfect. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. 
Ja. <laughs> Just a layup from Morten. Ja. Yeah. Here's a chance for Birdie. Oh, no. Man, not at all. No. Just not giving the chance. It was slammed down. I was... Ooh, yeah. And that one was just. <laughs> he saw your putt and he was like, "Make sure to give it the right height." And, yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> that so one. that's your solution to yeah. get around the wind, just fucking. I guess full so. Speed. Yeah. That was full speed. Yeah. I was kind of. I was, I was hoping on a birdie there, and somehow, that, that was a par. Yeah. But uh, definitely wanted that par. But uh, windy conditions. Pars is, is pretty good here. Birdies is, of course, better, but Pars is important. Eagles, almost impossible, but who wouldn't want one? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if we saw any during this tournament, but it is a par four at only 177, but here we are at hole five. Yeah, 93 meters. Want to keep it low under this branch or go high highs around this is an island hole so you want to keep it yeah between the flags here this is long so very uh very interesting green here and just a tough hole kind of in this wind yeah and to get the birdie you see when the the pro tour comes to town they look at this hole and it's like it's nice but we're yeah. gonna add some ob to make it trickier all these flags are not part of our daily and routine and just skip too much that was too too skippy <laughs> too much power Probably too much power that too went, much power that wind just carried it yeah. i think but uh i totally know that feeling of just too too long yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah but, uh, Morten is at the edge, but but he was safe. He was still safe. a long part in this in this wind. This is tough, but uh, the forehand seems to be a little yeah. more safe yeah. in this wind. Definitely, good choice here. And to be honest, they the pro tour did add a lot of flags to make it an island green, but going long has always been ob. Yeah, so that's uh, true. Oh. <laughs> Speaking of OB Long. Yeah, that was a good carry. <laughs> yeah, that was a good carry. Wow. You're right. You're absolutely right. And then Morton yeah. gets it. And Morton Boom. is just. He's a passionate really guy, so you can see when it's working. Sweet. Sweet Morton. Yeah. That was a good part. He gets a. Yay, <laughs> Jay! From behind the bench. Yeah, that's nice to and see. And I'll get the Neji. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's your channel, so yeah. you can decide not oh, to get. Oh, that was close. That's OB too. Oh, <sighs> this seemed. It, it seems like to be a fairly. Oh, small... <laughs> come on, man! Can't even remember this one, man. Wow, that's tough. Tough I, hole. Everyone's having a terrible time, and like. Officially, it's a pretty simple hole, but you guys are struggling out there. Yeah. But so is the flag. So, I mean, part of uh, the explanation. Yeah. There you go. Solid. Double bogey. Yeah. Uh, yeah. On a hole that you definitely want to par on. But you I want to birdie I, it. I, yeah, you, yeah, you oh, want to yeah. birdie it. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. you definitely want to par as well. <laughs> 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 yeah. But these conditions just... Uh, tough yeah all right so hole six we're in the woods we're maybe not out of the wind but uh the gaps become tighter yeah 85 meters you want to put probably mid-range here you could do putters as well or you can do sidearm but uh most guys would probably do uh, any backhand and let the disc kind of do the the drift going straight oh he was too much left on that modern the hyzer was too wide and this is a flip or putter kind of turnover going through not the perfect line but going through and having a putt there it's pretty good and you see the sawed off stump there on the ground this hole used to be a lot trickier because there was a big tree in the way 
Uh, but the storm cut it down, so yeah, it's not easy, but it's easier. And you saw how there, how it's possible to slide into Circle One. Oh man! Yeah, yeah. They didn't cut down that tree. Thank God the <laughs> path is not OB. Yeah, so. yeah, that's true. Sewn up shot here. How's that sewn feeling? That one felt pretty good, but just uh, a little short. Yeah. Yeah. Morton is side arming it to the basket. Good up. Yeah. Again, kids at home, don't try to putt with the sidearm. But he was far from the basket, so it's probably just lay up. Trying to give it a run there. He was well. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, that was a good par. Yeah, that was a good par. That's a good good feeling of that putt in this wind. It seems though like being aggressive with your putts in the wind is a strategy, but uh, of course the miss will yeah be take be you even far <laughs> be, be be even longer. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah. And you see this uh, card struggling a little bit because it's one of the holes that you definitely want to get a birdie on. Um, so is hole seven because it's very short, but my god, there's a lot in the way. Oh, yeah, this is a tight, it's called a pinball. So, this is um, 68 meters in the woods, probably like three meters wide, I would guess. And um, gotta keep it in the middle, trying <laughs> to just to slide it up there. It's a fast, uh, kind of packed ground all the way up there that's what happened when you have one of the most popular courses in the world is the ground gets beaten down really yeah. good so if you just manage to keep it straight and low then it'll slide all the way up there but we have yet to see anyone maybe oh, yeah. here crazy flip up oh the wind is also from right to left there you can see the flag and there you saw why we call it the pinball hole, because if you hit a tree, you usually hit a, hit a second tree as well. Going straight with the beat up zone and just getting stopped by the small, small stump there. That was that was a good, good shot there, but just unlucky on the... Yeah, because low and straight is what you want it. Yeah. This is an old old D-line zone I got from Ashton, so thank you, Ashton. Little shout out. Little shout out. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Nice. Yeah, that was. Ashton cool. is uh, one of the Danish players who have a local advantage, so we are also hoping for him to be in the mix to make sure that uh, the Finns aren't winning it all again this year. So high hopes for. Ashton? Yeah, no birdies on a very no birdieable hole. Oh, yeah. Hole 8. Hole 8, 156 meters. This is a par 4. You want to land it. Yeah, you got to go through these trees. All these three trees are essentially you got to go through and then kind of land around here. And up further is even better, and then up shot like a low side arm here it's through those two best. branches. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can do that. <laughs> yeah, I tried that, but then hitting the green and, and kind of skipping it up towards the basket. And um, definitely, this is uh, this is one of my one my of design best. on on the on the course. Um, so you designed the hole, so you're definitely yeah. gonna birdie it. Yeah, yeah. guaranteed. Yeah. Now you see the side arm. Yeah. And Last. The, uh, the wind is just heavy here. You, it's ripping from right to left here, so it's just gonna smash it down, and not you cannot really control the angle on it because you're gonna go so straight. But but that's just um, so tough to put it out straight and kind of let it turn into the wind. And still get the height right. So, good, nice. so um, last tough, year so we did a whole preview with you and Ashton playing this hold, and you threw down the roller because you said the wind was right for oh, it. Oh yeah, 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 that's right. But I don't know. The, maybe that was a different wind yeah, than today. Yeah, yeah, the wind has to come from from kind of left to right. This was the, uh, just the opposite of it. So, but morning 
He's getting up where he could probably want to land in his first shot. And this is going. It's through going through! Most. Oh, it, kind of everything. Know. That's pretty good. Just outside the circle. Okay. Famous forehand. The KJ forehand. Oh, roller. Yeah, Even I more need famous. It. I, I know. I, I knew that I had to put it out on a on an angle and let it kind of the wind kind of push it push it left to right kind of and uh, it was it was fighting but uh, hit a little or oh, hit a tree on the way that one needed to fight too as well and unfortunately didn't so he's up again yeah but this time with an on. open look oh oh yeah. oh, oh. oh. <laughs> flashing close. chains very close and you can give Good it a job. run because it's like uphill behind the basket, so uh, you won't. Uh, you can, but it, prefer probably just to park it. Yeah, <laughs> but like, I mean, you won't go that long I I if you miss it. So, you know, you no. can give it a run. Yeah. I mean, this I'm is definitely, I'm definitely trying, yeah. <laughs> just heavy wind. Maybe someone in the comments, if you uh, tell us how many times we mentioned the wind in this episode, there'll be a little prize for you. Yeah. You got to go back and count. Oh, yeah. Good putt there. Yeah. Nice putt awesome. save. From Piri. It's very windy. <laughs> <laughs> Add it to the count. Add it to the count. No. The one closest to the truth, we will give a prize. The only problem is who's going to count. Yeah. We sure aren't. No. Morton getting in the basket. Oh, yeah, getting that bogey. Yeah, you're getting a par here. Yeah, I'm getting a par it's here. okay, but I know it's one of those holes you want to birdie. Yeah, but yeah, moving yeah. on to hole number nine. Yeah, one, one, one meters. Yeah, yeah, you gotta go low here, kind of. Yeah, it's you could also get go a big high in this wind, but uh, I'm trying just to throw it straight at the basket more or less. Of course, trying to go through these two trees that are essential. You go through. Um, That's a nice result. He's yeah. just outside the circle, 11 outside, meters. Yeah. He has a putt. Yeah, going onyx here, I think, and just yeah, not really the best. Oh, out of my hand. Not the best. <laughs> no, <laughs> I won't call it. Oh, he almost did the same, but he got a little lift there. Yeah. And perhaps sliding on. Oh, that's really nice. Yeah, that's good. There's Inside an the opening circle. out there to the right. So, like, if you can manage to hise her in there. Uh, oh, and here you see Morden going with that uh, big hyzer. But the wind is also kind of in your head as well. So oh, this is just so turning over going straight instead yeah. of fading yeah yeah so it was kind of heady wind from right here so an upshot here getting that low skip but with and this holes you you rarely see too many uh too many red scores because even though you miss your your, yeah. your drive you see That's it's true oh, oh. Bad, bad be parking is very open and uh you can, of course, there's some wooden holes, but... You can save your par. And they added a lot of OBs as well, of course. And Here was a birdie putt. Layout. Here yeah. was a birdie putt. Just outside. But, uh, close. Uh, oh. No, no, yeah. no, no, no. Just not feeling it. Morden. Oh, what was that? Morden is not feeling it. Did he hit a branch? I hope so. I hope he had a branch. Yeah. But a uh, yeah, good comebacker, but still just a little right. He's had better days, but he manages to smile and laugh it off. Yeah. You get the par. So I get said the there par. would be very few bogeys on this hole, but I think we're looking at at least one. Yeah. You get the par. So does Jonas. And Morden tapping in for the bogey, double bogey, and par for Piri. Yeah. And that was uh, the front nine. Wow. Yeah. Not exactly what you guys were looking for, but if you're counting at home, I will say it again. The wind was 
heavy. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, maybe the wind will be completely gone in bag nine. Who knows? You should definitely tune in and uh, we'll see you there. Like and subscribe. KJ Disc.